During Virtual RoboCup 2020, the RoboCup Asia Pacific RCAP, Co-Space Challenge Organizing Committee has worked with co-space partners around the world to organize the International Co-Space Online Challenge. iCool Challenge iCool Challenge provided an opportunity for 600 students from around 25 regions across the world to remotely take part in Virtual RoboCup 2020 through RCAP Co-Space Challenges from home. The iCool Challenge is in an international friendlies format whose primary purpose is to bring our RoboCup community together through learning and sharing during this challenging time. Finalists will be selected by a panel of judges based on the results of the 24-hour challenge. Finalists are invited to submit video presentations of their learning experience and strategies for the iCool Challenge. Highlighted matches and sharing sessions will be selected by the judges and featured on the RCAP Academy YouTube channel for participants to share and learn from their peers. This provides a great opportunity for our RoboCup family to continue support and learn from each other. According to YouTube, there were more than 60,000 views from 50 regions during the iCool. <laughs> of given criteria in order to be eligible for the Best Presentation Award, Most Creative Presentation Award and Best Strategy Award. A panel of judges will evaluate the video presentations. On August 15, 2020, online interviews were held and live-streamed on RCAP Academy YouTube channel. The first question is, can you explain more about the district system? How was the behavior of the robot modified based on the district? And I was studying the map, then it was at this, um, on the center red, I realized that the robot had to turn left using variables. 
So the first question is, how do you define a path in your strategy for a new map? How do you dynamically choose a path in many paths? Now take your time, you have eight minutes. And I have used the ultrasonic sensors to avoid the corner so that uh, it does not get stuck in the corner. And, uh, it's not a fixed value because it will keep on turning until it doesn't see the wall. Uh, if the robot is far away from the deposit area, how will the robot realize its path planning and complete deposit? When the X and Y coordinates would be set to zero, we would use the we would use a copy of the latest recorded coordinates. Cup Asia Pacific Confederation, Fernando Ribeiro, Vice President, RoboCup Federation, Roman Meshyakov, Trustee, RoboCup Asia Pacific Confederation, special guests from RCAP. First of all, I'd okay. like to congratulate all the participants. They are the future. Congratulations to all of you. Hello, everyone. On behalf of RoboCup Asia Pacific, I would like to thank all the participants judges, parents, for supporting this Virtual RoboCup event. Virtual RoboCup provides us a new space to connect students from all over the world. Thank you.